Good morning from Malacca. Are you guys ready for some breakfast? Yes. Yeah, now it's 9 a.m., so it's not super early, but it's early enough that most of these businesses are closed. But there are some Daddy. restaurants that we found. Yes, sir. We are going to eat dinner. Breakfast. Ah. Are you hungry? All right. Yeah. So uh, this particular place serves all types of buns and yummy stuff like that. So yeah, should be able we're to gonna... get something vegetarian. Yeah, I, I, I think so. We reviewed the menu online. It looked pretty good. Yeah. It's just basically opposite this big uh, temple, this big mosque here. So from the mosque forest, on the street bud, on the sidewalk. So just right from the mosque here, I mean, this is a very popular mosque to visit, to the restaurant right here. Forest, hold on, there's a car coming, bud. So when you walk up, you can already see the menus just perfectly aligned. We'll go, uh, we'll get a table, we'll make our order. Yeah, all right, so here are, of course, are the buns. Ah, those look amazing. Sticky rice. Sticky rice, okay. There's the one. What are these? Same. Same? Sticky rice? Okay, we'll have we'll have that sticky rice. Are those are pork buns? Yeah. Barbecue. Barbecue? Red bean. Okay, red bean? Mm -hmm. So we'll take um Oh, what are these? Salt egg and bun. Oh, we want both those. Alright. Yeah, we'll take those. Wow, good last shoe. Oh yes. Man, perfect timing. Phew. Oh yeah, okay. Alright. Let me show you. Okay. Beautiful. Those are fish? Yeah, fish ball. Okay. Then go with your chicken. Okay. And there's a century with the pork. Pork, okay. So you take the coriander. Coriander with the pork. Okay. okay. Coriander and pork, got it. Okay, so I think I know what we want to do. Uh, we'll certainly take those two little egg balls. We'll take one of the, the gelatinous rices. Is that? Yeah, yeah. Is that okay? Is that veg? Yep. Okay. Yep. Oh, there's more more sticky balls in there. Perfect. Two. Do you have more of these? It's okay. 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 And then we'll take uh, barbecue pork. What? Uh, two. Two. And you said red bean. Yep. One one red bean. One red bean. Okay, one fish ball, because Forrest will eat that. Yeah, he'll love that. And then can we have uh, coriander? Coriander? Yes, sir. And... Prawns? Prawn? Sure, just okay. one. Okay, and is that right. it? Let's start with that. Okay, we'll start with this. This is great. So again, the menu <laughs> is there, but this guy will just simply pull the lid off and so say, here's what we got. That's perfect. All right, thank you, sir. Thank you. And we're just gonna step right over here to enjoy. Okay, guys, we're gonna start with this stuff. Oh, Forest so fish balls. Uh, Wait, are they gonna start with the same? Let's get him a fork. Yeah, I think we'll just get him granite barbecue pork, yeah. cedar barbecue pork. Ooh. They're probably pretty hot. They just came out to see we gotta rip it apart and we'll dig in. I'm gonna definitely start with one of these. Boy, I got you little fish balls. What's this one called? Barbecue pork bun. Well, it's sweet. It's kind of sweet in a way. Okay. Um, very flavorful. Is it, uh, yeah, flavorful. Cool. I might have to get one of those myself. That's oh, a pork good. bun. Now, Kel, that thing is big. It's going to be it's hot. Good. It might be hard to rip into. Hold on. Let me just wait it. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Oh, yes, yeah. That's awesome. That. That's like heaven this right there for you, huh? This is my dream. Yes, it is. Red <laughs> bean. Red bean steam buns. I love them. Nice. I've never seen one this big. Ooh. Mm. I wouldn't do the apple. Apple. Yeah, it's sweet. Yeah. Creamy, steamy. It's delicious. Nice way to it's start the, the day. Best texture ever. Yeah. All right, now I'm gonna go in for one of these uh, little egg. I, I, I don't know what he called these, but they look they look to me like those little egg uh, uh, charts that I've seen all around town. Is it also a steam bun? It's a steam bun. It's got a bready texture, but it, it might there might be some kind of filling in here. Let's see. Oh, oh yeah, that's gonna be good. I want those stop steaks. Amazing. Is it sweet or Oh, it's good. It's well, it's hard. It, it's sort of neutral, honestly. It's not too sweet, not too salty, but there is that custard on the inside. Boris, you want a little custard cupcake? 
You want the cupcake? No. No? Okay, Sita, you want to get in on this one? It's quite delicious. Yep, yep. Yeah. Mmm. Because they had some stuff like it. it. Filling in yeah, it. yummy, right? Creamy. Quite delicious. Th really that's good. one of my favorites. Mm -hmm. Awesome. I need those chopsticks. Horace, go for your fish ball, dude. Uh, my chopsticks. The chopsticks are, are more interesting than the food at this point for him. All right, up next we have the, granted, you might want to get on this. This is uh, cilantro pork, coriander pork as they called it. Let's see if I can use my chopstick skills here. Yeah, Granny, you'll probably like that one. Mm -hmm. yeah, I'll take this. And they got the sauce. I assume this is some kind of like a chili sauce. Mm -hmm. Keep it sweet oh. and spicy. Mm -hmm. Nice, a bit sweet. And spicy, really, it's just the mix. I think they mixed the two sauces together. But the cilantro, whoa, made a mess. The cilantro is pretty good. Mm. All right, so they just brought out a tray of fried options. So we have the steam and the fried kale. Is there anything jumping out at you there? Yes, definitely spring roll. Spring roll, nice. Please, spring roll. Thank you. Okay. Um, cool. What, what is this one? This is a um, uh, glutinous ball. Glutinous ball? Rice cake and yam. Okay, and this one? This is yam ball with barbecue pork. Ah. This one, no pork. No Should pork? I try that one? No, yes, please. please. Mm -hmm. Thank mm -hmm. you. Cool. Okay. Barbecue. And we'll have this one as well? Okay. Well, thank you, ma'am. Oh, Perfect. Okay. Barbecue thank pork you. with with rice? Yeah. No. My name is yeah. Yam. Oh, yeah. that'd be good. It's a glutinous ball with rice cake and yam. Rice cake and yam, and then this is with sweet yam. <laughs> and pork. And pork. Nice. That'd be good. Yeah. Great. You just pick that up and pop it in there. This is just crispy outside. Mm. Oh, okay. I don't know if you can see yeah, it. Yeah, sure, sure. Um, it is glutinous. <laughs> yeah, glutinous. It's pretty good. It has the same inside as the um little... Uh, Steam bun. Yeah, mm. but the outside makes it like really crunchy and good. Nice, good. And so is a good choice with some of the fried? Yeah. Nice. Got one? Uh, sure, why not? Take that one go. Yeah, a little fried. Oh. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Man, nice and flaky. Mm. I think Sunny would be really proud of our ball-shaped foods. We have a lot of balls on the table. A lot of balls. Fish balls, glutinous ball, pork ball. A pork ball? Mm-hmm. Mm. So I'm gonna go for one of these uh, prawn dim, dim sums here. You got one there, Granite? Yep. All right, I'll take it into the sauce. Can I try some sauce? Excellent. Yeah, kind of like a, a, a prawn paste in there, I think. Pretty good. Is that a chili sauce? It's, it's like a sweet chili. It's not, it's not sweet. Like, should I put my spring oh, yeah, in Oh, yeah, 100%. Okay. 100%. Now, Cedar, how's this one? It's really good. The outside is nice and crusty. And in the middle of the crust, it's like kind of soft. Oh, excellent. A good treat. Nice. Yum, yum. Okay, well, there's only one thing left on the table to try, and that's what's inside this leaf here. I mm -hmm. believe that's some kind of sticky rice. We'll give that a try next. Okay, now it's time to dig into the leaf that has the sticky rice in here. I wonder what color. I'm thinking purple. Oh, my goodness. Multi it oh, is wow. not nice. sticky rice. So it must have that, that maybe that brown palm sugar or yeah. look at there's something in here. Oh, it's hot. Mushroom? That's Maybe a mushroom. mushroom. Nice, okay. Yeah. Cool. Mushroom, yeah. Mushroom cool. with sticky rice. I know you're not a huge fan of mushrooms, so I will get in there. Yeah. And get in that mushroom. It looks so good. Mm. Yeah, earthy. Got that kind of earth tones element to it. I'm gonna dig in with some some of forest chopsticks. Okay. Woo! It's gonna be warm. Mm. Oh, you can take oh, oh. this is pork. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's okay. Well, we'll uh, we'll, we'll eat the pork. But the okay, how's the rice taste? You can take the only the rice. The rice, yeah, yeah. yeah. Of course, of course. So the rice is good, savory. Actually, she just told us that there's pork in it, so I'm just ate that rice. So I won't I won't pass these, it off. But it does have big mushrooms in it. Yeah, typically these kind of things, it's um like chunks. You know what I mean? So yeah, it's like you could get the rice. Like I do chunks. see one little piece of pork here. Oh, that's what's happening. That one says pork. Yeah, let's see if I can grab it. 
But it is sticky, mm -hmm. but it's, um, you know, like a sweet and sour, almost like a soy. Nice. Granny, you want to get onto this rice? You can use your fork. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Rice is like, um, it has some kind of sauce on it, maybe. But it kind of tastes like, um, sweet. Yeah. She said there's pork and mushrooms in there. That's a piece of pork you got there. Mm -hmm. Pork tastes pretty good. Yeah. Especially with the rice. Yeah, nice. All right, so we're going to spend the next couple minutes just kind of wrapping up the dishes here, but a great first stop here in Malacca. It's stop number two. Now, Kelly, you might think I'm crazy. This is a duck noodle house. Yes. But I peruse online. It looks like they do a braised tofu. Oh, that would be delicious. So you should we, we should all have yet another joint eatery. Yes. Okay. okay, good. So the name of this place, I'm going to totally butcher it, but let's give it a try. Uh, Tingikera Duck Noodle Restaurant. So we're going to go in, see what it's all about. I'm going to order uh, the, the duck noodles, um, tofu, and egg. Ah. And how many pieces of tofu? One more, one piece. Okay, can I get two pieces? Okay. And then can I get the, the pig ear? Pig ear, yeah. Okay, I take pig ear. Okay. And then, um, what do you, oh, the soup? Soup? No, 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 how many more you want? Uh, just one, but, but uh, big's okay. okay. Big. Yeah, or medium, medium. Medium. Medium, sorry, medium, okay. thank you. And, and I think that's... The egg, how egg. many egg you want? Uh, two egg. Two egg, two, two, egg, two tofu, duck noodle, Soup, uh, pig ear, intestine. Intestine, maybe a, just a small, okay. small intestine. We try. Okay. Okay. Well, and you bring to the table, or I, I wait here. Uh, you I will bring down? to the table. Okay. All right. Thank you for the help. Okay. <laughs> awesome. Yeah. So this guy I was talking about, he's been coming here for years, years. He said, he said it's like uh, the best, the best, the best in Malacca. All right, guys. So I was just talking to a dude in line. He's been coming here forever. We ended up ordering what was going to be a small order turned into a big order. Said, oh, you got to get this. You got to get that. You got to. So we're going to get pig ear, pig intestine, pig, lots of pig, um, pig soup, the pig noodles. That's like what they're famous for. The soup, the tofu, and two eggs, which are cooked in the broth. What do you think about all this? That seems like a lot. Seems like a lot. It's going to be a whole spread. We might have to take a small break uh, in the food tour. <laughs> Let it digest, but we'll see. Cedar, are you pumped up for pig ear, pig intestine, pig soup? Um, I forget what else. Tofu and eggs. Yeah, why not? It should be good. And they're gonna bring it to the table. Forrest, what ha what's going on with the teas? Why does he have my tea? And why does he have my straw? And what is going on? He's like doing some kind of crazy drinking game. Yeah. Oh, I think double. He likes the tea. Is, is the tea yummy? All right, our kind of mixed collection has shown up and they combined everything into a bowl. So in this one bowl, we have pig intestine, pig ear, braised tofu, and eggs. Yep. In this bowl, this is the kind of what they're known for, the most famous. This is the duck noodle. And this is the soup that the guy in line's like, oh, you got to get the soup. So, all right, kids. Are you ready? This is the tofu. That looks like pig ear. I'm going to go for a piece of this pig ear here. And see, you're going for the tofu. All right, it's all that same sauce. Here we go. Nice guys. That's nice. Fatty, delicious. Mmm. That gravy's pretty rich. The tofu is like squishy, and the flavor makes it sweet. Nice. You like the texture? Cool. I'm gonna go for some of these intestines. Should be pretty chewy, as I know intestines. Excellent. Yeah, very good. Pig intestine. Try it. You can try that. See, that's pretty good. Yeah, I'll try that. Are you going for the egg? Oh, that's the pig intestines. Yes, actually, yeah, the intestines are really good. The egg is really good. The egg is tasty, also soaked in that same kind of broth. Yeah, this is great. All right, I think I'm going to go for one of these egg slices. Egg half. Oh, don't drop it. Mm. Excellent. Yeah, more of that pig ear. Tofu, granite. Tofu's pretty good. Yeah, just 
just soaks up the flavor. Add some more pig ear. Again, quite, quite the collection of dishes. I think my favorite in this bowl is probably the intestines, although the eggs are pretty good too. Yeah. Mm. Mind you, the intestines are tofu. Intestines are tofu. What about your Cedar? Mm, mine might be the egg. The egg? Nice. Yum. Yeah, okay. So again, this kind of mixed plate is, uh, is pretty outstanding. I'm going to go for one more piece of this pig ear. A nice big fatty piece. Excellent. Just braised. Praise goodness. All right, so this is sort of their signature dish here, guys. This is the duck noodle. So it's kind of what put them on the map, I think. So you just grab a little of the duck, twist it around, sort of like spaghetti, really. There's all types of um, little sprouts in there as well. Yeah, okay. Mm. Mm. The noodle had delicious sauce. I think I had like a, uh, uh, is it duck or pork? This is duck actually. The duck, I had just a little bit of duck in it and it tastes like delicious. Yeah, nice. It's a bit salt on the salty side, which I like. And the noodles are kind of fun because they're sort of like pasta noodles, like spaghetti almost. Yeah. Go for it. <laughs> the big bite. Yeah, this is a this is a good one. I can see why this is the signature dish. These other kind of the mixed platter here was more like a bunch of side dishes tossed into one bowl. Yeah. Oh man, big one. Hmm. Oops. I got this. Hmm. Messy. Yeah, a little messy. That's okay. Excellent. The duck, flavorful. It's just soaking in that juice. Yeah, outstanding. All right, so the third kind of item here is the soup. This is the one that the gentleman who's been coming in for years really recommended. He said, you've got to get the soup. And you can see there's just that layer on top of a fad, some kind of brine, probably either duck or pork, that would be my guess. Pretty good. Ooh. I like it. Yeah, I really, like it. yeah, you have that rich broth flavor. Although and, it's, kind of, it's kind of light, yeah? And the greens make it taste better. Those green onions are delish. Yeah, definitely light. Yeah, it's a, it's a light, rocky flavor. I mean, rich, rich in in taste, uh, but a light one. Mm. Yeah. Wow. Of all the dishes, which one's your favorite? Uh, the noodles. The noodles. Yeah, the duck noodles. The noodles. Noodles as well. Mine, mine as well. The duck noodles. You gotta come when you if you have room in your tummy. You get the extra add-on. Again, that was pig ear, tofu, and eggs. Oh. All of which, oh, and the intestines. All of which are really pretty delicious. Mm. So again, a, a second spot, second stop on our food tour, historic roast duck noodles, quite delicious. Next up on our food journey, Sun Mei Kong Saute Restaurant. Now, Kelly, I, yes. I'm confident. <laughs> Now the braised tofu didn't work out so much in the last one because it was all smathered in pig intestines. Mm -hmm. But I think this one we're good. Yes. They're gonna have chicken saute, pork saute, chicken intestine saute, chicken liver saute, and but rice cakes. Yes. Rice I'm cakes for the with yeah in that with, mess, with the peanut message. sauce, <laughs> cucumber onion. I've did all this research online, but this is the spot right here. Let's uh, check it out. Let's go and check it out first. Yeah. Are you hungry for some saute? You like the chicken sautés? No, you like the pork sautés. No, okay, well, well, we'll, we'll see about all that. All right, well, let's get in here and get some yummy, yummy sautés ordered. So once we're seated, we order right here at the cash register. Hello, ma'am. Thank you for coming in. Oh, yeah, yeah. very good. Last way. Yeah, That's yeah. Fine. Yeah, first time, now uh, open. Yes. Okay, can I order uh, pork and chicken four? Can, can. Yeah, four, four chicken, oh, four. four pork. Oh, oh. Yeah. Chicken also, oh. Pork intestine three. Three. Liver. Pork liver three. And then uh, rice. rice. Yeah, one plate. One plate. Rice. Onion. One plate. And then the drink um, sugar cane and water chestnut. How many? Four. Another? Um, other mineral Best fresh coconut. coconut, one. Mineral water, one. Small, huh? Small. Yeah. Right. Okay. Okay. 
Okay. And then maybe I order more. Ten. Do I pay now or pay at the end? We pay later also ten. At the end? Yeah. Okay. All right. Thank you. And they'll bring to the table? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. Thank you, ma'am. So super easy. You can see the guys. Uh, can I take pictures? Okay. Okay. It's okay. The guys are making up all the intestines. Looks good, guys. Yeah. 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 Ena. Ena. Saisuka. Nice. Yeah. Looking good. Just very uh, going through hand, hand, hand secured. Okay, guys. I got so I ordered. Uh, I got the chicken. I got the pork. I got the pork intestine. I got the pork liver. I got the sugar cane water chestnut. That's probably that drink there. I got four of those. I got one coconut for, and I got a mineral water. Sound good? Okay. Got a, got a, some cars for entertainment here. Yeah. All right, that lady is really sweet too. Okay. What, Cucumber onions. What drinks did you get? This is the rice cakes. Oh yeah. This is the this is the sugar cane water chestnut drink. Kind of excited to try. So it's water, sugar cane, sugar, brown sugar, water chestnut. This is for Forest. Thank you. That's the that's the sauce. That's gonna be good. Boom, baby. This one's for cedar. That's pretty good. Pretty good. Look at this. Oh, that is good. That's looking delicious. Is that is that chili? I think it's chili. So it's gonna be a spicy peanut sauce. Yum. We each can get our own little bowl of the sauce, maybe. Give everyone a blue. Like orange, like spicy yeah, orange. Yeah, kind of. I see it all coming at you. Oh, wait. Try it with the cucumber. Why are we waiting on the sautés? Yeah. Okay. Do you want a cucumber too? I see. Mm -hmm. Baba, I got it. Whoa. Chili. Check out this rice cake reminds me of long tongue. Oh, it looks it, like long tongue, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. Just like a little chewy bit. Should I try it? Yeah, definitely. Okay. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Rock pipe. No, the spice. Oh. In the back of the throat. A little heat, huh? The, actually, the peanut sauce is really hot, like temperature hot. But the oil or the chili is uh, got a kick to it for sure. I'll go for it with the cucumber. Try it with the sticky rice. Oh, you can see like that the way that chili oil just kind of clings to that uh, yeah. cucumber. I like, I like it. Woo. Bring in the bring in a little heat. Just a little bit. In the yeah, throat. that's okay. I think I'm becoming used to like that that chili sauce, but it's definitely a, a little heat behind it. Yeah, the uh, sugar cane chestnut drink helps for what? Mm -hmm. I'm tasting like a mm -hmm. something sweet in that peanut sauce, like a. Sugar, yeah. Apricot or Maybe. sugar, or something fruity almost. Mm. The drink is really good. I'm gonna slam that. Forrest, I got you a coconut. You like your coconut? You like it. You're cray cray. All right, all right, all right. So those sautés should be up any second, I'm sure. Awesome, thank you. Okay, kids, so here we go. I can, I see, okay, I can already guess. Liver. Liver. In, ch yeah, in chicken. Test, chicken. Intestines. Intestines. Four. Four. Okay, which ones do you want to start with, Cedar? Want to go with these darker ones? Want to go with these? The chicken first? Okay, chicken. 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 All right, chicken. Little little bite size sautés. Woohoo! Here we go. Nice and spicy. Yeah. Hot. The, the sauce has spice that mm. kicks right in the back of the throat. Yeah. yeah, it's nice and spicy. Oh, I love it. The chicken's tender, juicy. You're hitting that saute, like charcoal flavor. Yum. Yeah. I can eat about a dozen of those, salty, I think. Right? Yeah, a little salty. Let's see if Forrest wants his, his chicken piece. Forrest! Forrest, you want your chicken? He's busy uh, Instagramming. Instagramming. All right, all right. Okay, let's go with the dark one next. This liver, right? The liver? It's fatty. 
Yeah, fatty, delicious. Really high. Here's some pico first. Cool. All right, going back in for the sauce. The the liver. Yeah. Smoky taste. Mm -hmm. And it kind of has a chickeny taste. Yeah. Yeah, no, this is pork liver, but you are, you are right about that, that pork, that distinct pork liver flavor is there of liver. Smoky. Smoky. I like it. Flavorful. Yeah. Oh, a different texture. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, which one do you want to hit next? Pork. Pork? All right. My kind of people. Got it. All right. So again, yeah, it's got. It almost has that same color as the chicken. So I wonder if it's the same kind of, mm. kind of uh, seasonings. Yeah, it's a little darker than it though. It tastes really nice. Like, there's like a flavor that it's like the spicy flavor, but it doesn't burn your mouth. Yeah, it's the right kind of heat. Not too, not too much. This one's really juicy. Yeah. Yeah. I really like it. Good. 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 Okay. Here we go. And the skin's really good. Mm. Crispy on the outside, Please. chewy on the inside. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, that's good. See, do you like that pork one? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, you want a carb? There you go. Okay, I think I might have to go for a cucumber break. My mouth is kind of on fire. Yeah. <laughs> All right, just a cucumber. This is probably where the, the heat's coming from, honestly. But it's so good. They also serve it with onion. So you got this like red onion bit. I hope I don't regret this onion decision. Yum, crunchy. Up next, pork intestines. Yeah, and now this is our second time today eating intestines. Well, this one is your first one. That's right, that's right. I think you're gonna like it. It's got that same uh, seasonings. Yeah, it looks like spaghetti tubes. Yeah, spaghetti. Mm. Good. It's really batty. Like? It's really batty. I like it. Yeah, 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 it's nice. I mean, uh, they say intestines are good for you. For us here, you want a bite? All right. Good, right? Mm. Mm. Well, Quite a delicious spot. We have one chicken and one pork left over. I thought for sure Forrest would go for it, but I guess not. Go for the pork. Cedar, you want that extra chicken? Are you gonna finish your intestines? Can I finish them for you? Cool, thank you. Yeah, it takes a minute. Yeah, yeah, that's okay. And that's the best part about being a dad, honestly, is uh, all the leftovers that the kids don't eat. So, woohoo. That's a win-win, really. Amazing. So to come in for a quick saute fix, and Kelly, you got your coconut? I got forest got, coconut. Oh, yeah, look at yeah. you. Woo, I, I ordered, it. Yeah, I also ordered forest and coconut drink. You didn't go for it either. No, but it's delicious. Yeah, yeah. I'm willing to share the coconut. Mm. So if anybody wants coconut, let me know. How about it? Well, I will say, excellent stop. And tell, I mean, this place is uh, it's 1.30 on a Monday, and it's pretty busy. So we, uh, this is a good stop for sure, right here, kind of in, in this Malacca area. Bloop. One of our last stops here in the video is Puta Pairing. Now this is a famous uh, dessert here in Malacca. Rice flour, it's got that brown sugar kind of integrated like into it. Pula Malacca Yes, exactly, yeah. exactly that. And it is a uh, steamed dessert. So we're gonna jump in. There's actually a queue right now in the heat of the day, believe it or not. Yes, uh, so right. this is a very popular place. Trick, first trick is uh, crossing the streets. And it looks it like, oh yeah, it smells great. They make them handmade to order. And the smell of that rice flour and sugar is just in the air. Yep. Oh yeah. It smells amazing. Yeah. It smells like so good. fresh coconut yeah 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 and sugar sugary coconut quite nice opens at 1 p.m oh. you can see right to order from the batter to the steamers all that sugar on top that's gonna be excellent 
so fast. guys like a machine just total clockwork what do you think guy oh that's it's gonna be so good yeah i already can tell it's it's it looks like it's just a non-stop production from the time they open to the time they close yep i bet they just crank them out over and over and over and people just come and buy them up as fast as possible knowing yeah. that there's a limited amount of time that they're open. They're, and they're open limited. from like 1 to 4.30, so you really got to get in. It's 2.40 right now on a Monday. It's super hot outside, and there's still even just that queue. Now, I bet it queues up all day, but... Yep. Uh, they probably spend all morning just getting it ready. It looks like it's this huge dish of shaved coconut that probably takes forever just to get that all shaved up in the morning. Yeah, and I think there's some rice flour in that, too. Okay, then maybe give it a little bit of... Yeah, I actually I can see right there. So it's right there's a, they have a poster. Rice, gula, malaka, and coconut. So it's just yeah, nonstop. Kids are enjoying the view. You know, I was thinking five, but they it looks like they have boxes. So you have the big box, which is ten to twelve pieces, the medium box is eight pieces, the small box is five or six pieces. Right. So maybe um I mean, we definitely would want 10 or 12, yeah, but, but we've been eating all morning. This is true. <laughs> this is true. I don't know if these are one of these things that they're not like, are they good the next day? Or do you just kind of eat them when they're hot? So, uh, I bet when they're hot and fresh, that's the best. Why don't we do a, a five piece and then we can always get back in line. Yes, that's true. Just like, uh, almost like a machine. It's so cool. Everyone's got their little job. It's a five person operation. They are just going for it. That queue only took about 15 minutes, really, so they, they really kind of get him going. But, oh man, those are gonna be excellent. All right. 50, so. Oh, perfect, perfect. Yeah. All right, a little change. little change. So the deal is there's no seating uh, per se. I mean, it's just walk in, grab, and you go, and then there's nothing really out here. But there is this one little shady spot yeah. under the umbrella. This might work, right? I think so. He says really hot, so. Oh, pretty hot? Okay. Cool. All right, well, we'll do that. We're just gonna arrange. Oh, yeah, look at that. Oh, there's steam coming out of the box. Yep. Woo, it's almost too hot to handle. Yeah, fresh off the steamer. Wow, look at this. It's just, it's almost like a jelly. There is definitely too hot. <laughs> Woo, it's almost burning my hand underneath the box. So we'll let, those, we'll let those cool off for just a minute and then we'll get to eating them. It's that moment of time. Go for it, Granite. Wow. Oh, still too hot. Oh, uh, yeah, the bottom. Still too hot. Okay, all right. <laughs> Very hot. <laughs> oh, oh, so. ah, still too hot. Still too hot. Ah. All right. It's not that moment of time. Okay, Kelly, you're the brave one. First one up. It is really, still really hot. Almost too hot to handle. You can definitely see the coconut underneath. But the sugar is melty and gooey. Like a caramel, eh? Yeah. That, that looks like the epic piece right there. And there's some coconut. Oh yeah, wow. So a rice top, the coconut inside, or the sugar inside, the gula, ma gula malaka, and then the uh, coconut underneath. And it is good. It looks That's like Italy. That's the piece. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it does look like Italy. Very true, very true. Steve Rainfire. Woo! You got it? Yep. Nice, going for it. Good. My hands pretty good. Yeah? Mm -hmm. You wanna grab that one, Cedar? It's pretty hot. You wanna break it off? Just break you can break part of like a bite-sized piece off if you want. Oh, it's so That's still hot, hot. so hot. Wanna buy you this? There you go, yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Easy. Try that one. Mine's a little bit cooler. It's just so nice of that sugar, I bet. Yes. First one, try a bite. Oh, he's got the sugar. You want a little bite? Yeah. He's too hot. Oh man, poor kid. The coconut's actually salty. Oh really? So you have a salty with that extreme sugar. It's a great combination. So you're getting sugar, salt, sweet, chewy. Um, the sugars are a little crystallized, so little crystally chunks. That's perfect. Excellent. Great texture. 
Maybe you can rip it out and see there now. Oh, is it so hot still? There you go. You got a whole piece. Mm -hmm. Nice, Granny. You liking it? Mm -hmm. Worth the wait? Yep. I'd say mm -hmm. so. It looks delicious. Let me hold this for you. Ooh, all right. You can dig in. Okay, I'm gonna grab some of this one. Ah! Yeah, it's definitely hot. Mm. Probably the best way to eat it, though. Wow. Oh yeah. Fresh. Wow, that is good. The crystal sugar just hits you, man. That is sweet. <laughs> Kind of what we need this hot afternoon. Yeah, I would say. Up. And you can see all that, basically all the coconut they pile on top. Well, I guess technically on bottom when they flip it over, but that's a great combination. Nice on the I, Yeah, yeah, you, you take as much as you want. Hmm. And we still have two more. You can see why the queue probably never ends on a place like this. Wow, that is good. Forest? Do you want a little bite of the coconut? It's got the sugar. You don't want a little bite? Okay. Getting a little too hot out here for this guy. Mm. Wow, that's outstanding. Um, you want a little bite for mommy? So the food street scene in Malacca, it's, it's really almost endless. There's so many unique dishes to explore and uh wow it is it is epic you almost need like numerous days just to just to focus on the food so i would i would highly recommend oh, coming to malacca for the street food it's it's oh, incredible yeah. we've been eating non-stop since we got here yeah and they're all in all these restaurants are speckled all over town there are just so many i i would have a hunch that any street you turn down you turn left you turn right you're gonna find eateries and they're all gonna be pretty outstanding. And you can check online, but you can also just walk around and ask people. A hundred percent. Or ask your taxi driver or the bus yep. driver, where should we go, what should we try, what should we eat? And you're gonna get a lot of suggestions because this is super popular. Food. Yeah, yeah. Guys, favorite dish of the day? Uh, my favorite dish was probably those noodles. Oh uh, yeah, the, 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 the uh, duck noodles. Duck yeah, that was pretty good. That, that sauce is good. What about you, Grant? Mine was up. Mine was the uh, saute. Oh, the saute. Yeah, that was excellent. Boy, my. I really like this this, mor this morning where we kicked it off with everything. That whole smorgasbord of dim sum. Yeah, and yeah it's hard to, that's hard to yeah. beat, really. And those, that lady was so sweet. Yeah. So, yeah, my, my you but know, this my. This is really. Yeah, the dessert, excellent. Uh, man, hard to really pick for me, honestly. It was all just such a good spread and really representing the diverse. Uh, Food here yeah, in the locker. All the options, yeah. Yeah, quite delicious. Okay, everyone, we'll catch you in the next episode. Bloop.